The Garnet met the Gold in Doak Campbell on Saturday afternoon for the annual spring football game. Standout Jacques Patrick did not waste any time in making an impression, averaging over five yards per carry on the day and scoring the first touchdown of the game in the first quarter. I feel like um, we took a lot of steps forward from the beginning until the end. You know, it was a lot. Of, it was really competitive today, and um, the guys came out. You know, played really hard. You know, and we got. I feel like we got the results that we wanted. You know, he's, he's that back we need. You know, big, strong, powerful back. Uh, I mean, I know Jim. We got a lot of trust in him. I think he, you know, from the beginning of spring, really improved, and you know, I think he has a really good summer that you know could follow for next year as well. I feel like I've been playing a lot more mature football. Going um, playing behind Dalvin those these last two past years, he, you know, he showed me the ropes. So you know, when it was my turn to come up, you know, and, and do it, you know, I already knew the, the blueprint. So it was easy. I just followed the blueprint that Dalvin left behind. Wes has carried himself extremely well. Um, I mean, he's taking he's taking Cam under his wing, you know, teaching him the ropes and everything. And now he's taking that role of, like you said, Dalvin Cook. But I mean, he's not Dalvin Cook. He's Jaco S. Patrick, and now he's going to make a name for himself this year. I feel like you know I, I got better each and every day this spring. You know, I felt like it wasn't a day that I didn't improve my game. The spring game, you know, it was fun. We had a lot of fun out there. It was just good to see guys, you know, new guys, old guys make plays. This summer, Patrick will focus on the weight room, film, and technique to make him a dangerous weapon in the backfield this fall. I'm Lauren Vickers reporting for Seminoles.com.